inflation is this idea that came out in the early 1980s that if you start the universe in a, in a tiny little patch uh, dominated by what we call a false vacuum energy. Um, in other words, if it's not, if this little patch is not full of particles bubbling at a different temperature, but it's just a smooth patch of energy, then it can accelerate and expand by an enormous amount uh, and then convert into ordinary matter and energy and leave us with a very hot, dense, smooth, rapidly expanding universe, which is what we had in the early universe, a hot, dense, smooth, rapidly expanding phase. So you can get a universe that just looks like our early universe out of a very simple starting point. And since then, there's been no better model that has come along, certainly, no more promising um, alternative. And so many, many working cosmologists take inflation for granted. They assume that inflation must be right because it more or less fits the universe we see and the theorists have failed in coming up with an alternative that does just as well. Um, on the other hand, also we discovered there are problems with inflation. Number one, getting this initial starting patch of a smooth patch of space is much, much harder than people originally thought. We don't know how to do that in the first place. Number two, once inflation starts, it seems like it never stops. So instead of giving rise to only our universe, it gives rise to an infinite number of universes that all look different from each other. So instead of predicting uniquely that you should get a universe that looks like ours, it predicts some statistical ensemble of many different universes, and then you have to sort of talk about the probability that our universe looks one way rather than another way, and those probabilities seem to be completely ill-defined. <laughs> so inflation is still the best game in town. There's no good alternatives. There are attempts, but I would personally say that they're not very good right now. Um, so there's still the looming possibility that there is a correct alternative we just haven't thought of yet. But other than that, uh, inflation you know, is still the thing that most of us work on.